Hello guys, how are you doing? So, welcome back to my reactions, and as you can see I'm going to watch episode 165 of One Piece today. So in this last episode we got this really big revelation about this place where they are currently standing in, uh, this upper yard, and it was really crazy to think about this and how there was this knock-up stream right below uh, half of this island and sent this whole place uh, to the white white sea and became this, uh, this upper yard. And right now I'm thinking about um, like all of this situation, like all of this um, this island where Nolan found this gold, and then he when the others went there to see if it was true, uh, they didn't find anything, and uh, Nolan explained that he it was probably sent under the water or something, like the part of the island disappeared. Uh, so this explains a lot, and uh, it actually didn't go uh, under the water. It actually went to this white white sea. And uh, I wonder if there were actually people uh, in this uh, half of this island and if these people are actually these uh, Shandians or something. Like, this is uh, something that I'm trying to think about and uh, I can't know for sure right now, but uh, they will probably explain some of these things. But I honestly believe that there was probably some people uh, in this uh, part of the island that got sent to the White White Sea when this knock-up uh, stream happened. So, it's something that I really hope that they explain as soon as possible. It was really crazy to learn about these things uh, in this last episode and something that I was really not expecting. And we also got to see that uh, these uh, birds, uh, the south birds or something, uh, they are actually in this upper yard as well. So this ex explains uh, uh, like uh, this whole connection. I mean, they were in this island in the blue sea as well. So they probably, uh, some of them got sent to this place and... Um, I'm not too sure like if there's going to be some more uh, things revealed about them, but this explains why the south uh, birds uh, always point in this direction. I'm not too sure if uh, it's because of the location of this upper yard, like they are always uh, pointing to its location, like it would make sense I guess. But yeah, it's it's some details that I'm probably going to be more sure about uh, during these next episodes. And right now, I just really can't wait to see what's going to happen in this next one. So with this, I really hope you guys are ready and let's start it. I really love this story right now. That was such a big revelation. And changes a lot. I wonder if more islands were sent here with this method. Because we know there's more islands in this white white sea. And I wonder if the Shandians were actually a tribe originally from the the blue, the blue sea, but I'm not too sure about that. Yeah. These ones are really big though. Maybe they're just older, that's why they're bigger. Yeah, half of that of that house. It is so crazy. And the gold is probably there. And you know who's going to be happy. This girl. Just by knowing that there's gold there, pretty sure she's going to be interested on it. Yeah, this is what happened. I wonder if this happened to other islands in the Blue Sea as well. This knock upstream. I didn't remember the name in the last episode. The name of this. It's crazy to see that this happened.
I knew it. She's so happy. Time to hunt for the gold. <laughs> this Nami. So easy to predict. Well, not anymore apparently. Yeah. You know what happens to Nami when there's gold involved? And this guy is not going to be easy. There's Luffy and the others. Are they almost there or? Oh. Are they going to find Chopper? Wait, they need to go through another one. And the idea they only had to go through one. Well, it won't be string, most likely. Oh, it's that guy from before with the dog, right? I think those were around when they were showing him. Well... Oh... Because of the fight, right? Between the others? Oh yeah, it's them! Nice! <laughs> oh my god. They're going to be like, what? What did you just do? <laughs> yep. Yeah, they know about the devil fruits. Just gives me an int. But they should be on their side, right? And yeah, it's that guy from before. Exactly. I had already figured that out before, but... Hmm. And they should be on the same side. These guys. Hmm. This interaction between them was really good. I already give some hints.
Yeah, I want to learn more about that. Oh, there's these ones. Yeah, at this point they don't have a specific priest waiting for them. They're all fighting. Well then. I wonder what these guys are going to do. Yeah, they will eventually reach the place where this is all happening. It really feels like they have similar abilities, like with their, the palm of their hands. It feels like he did the same exact thing that Satori and Shura did before. Well, he wasn't there. Going down. Holy. Damn. I would be dizzy as well if I was there. Going down in that spiral or something. Even the loops and stuff. <laughs> I love it just enjoying everything. Damn. Hmm. I wonder if it's that or just a fire. I think it's just a fire, right? Oh no, it's actually... Not too sure. Could be because of all the fire. Ooh. Hmm, I wonder. Oh, they're back. Yeah, things were a bit wild there. Yeah. Is he inside treating them? Um, yeah, <laughs> oh my god, this Robin. <laughs> Don't jinx it.
There is. <laughs> Poor Chopper. At least he survived, which is really good. Hopefully he also managed to save Gunfall and the bird. Interesting way of climb climbing a tree. Maybe up there they are going to be able to see some new things. Like a roller coaster. With the sky sharks. That's bad. Just sky sharks. Yeah, sure. <laughs> oh, fireworks. It's a Gatling. Yeah, fireworks is like a a ball full of arms and legs, I guess. Use it before. With the arms is just Gatling. They're finally there. Now they're together at least. Sure. <laughs> Yeah, you had to remove it, it was burning. Damn, he's worried about him. <laughs> he's going to be happy. I love the sound he makes when he moves. <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> Although it's burning. Yeah, about that. Is he being treated? Yeah. I hope he survives. Because... The bird is okay as well. More like horse birds. But yeah. Oh! <laughs> There's this big war going on around them though. Um Okay then You're actually going to eat those Yeah, I think it's happening I wonder how it tastes Oh my god <laughs> Is he going to eat all of that? I mean, I wouldn't be surprised. Oh.
a good predict what you did. Technical mantra, yeah. Hmm. I have another idea. Can they... Hear what you sing? Yeah, that's the crazy thing about all of this. An island went all up, all the way up the, to this place, so... Is Luffy. The spear burn sings. Yeah, I want to learn more about this. Maybe mantra is uh, equal to everyone. There's only one type, and some people have it, like Aiza and the priest. And they can hear the what other people sing. Not too sure if it's like that, but... I don't think the, the gorillas have, um, are like bad at this point, I don't know. Yep. Especially not Nami. At this point there's no going back. Always excited. <laughs> and of course, Nami is going to be so happy. But yeah, that was really interesting. And I really love that they give some hints about this mantra. And I was thinking that there was probably some different types of mantras, like Devil Fruit Powers. But right now, I don't think it's like that. It really feels like um, it's some sort of skill that these guys have and uh, enables them to somehow... Uh, hear what other people think, or like, at least with this girl, Aiza, she was able to hear the voices of uh, Satori and Ganfall, and she noticed when the voices stopped, uh, which meant that they were probably defeated, so if we look at it, like, both Satori and uh, Ganfall uh, became um, unconscious after they got defeated, right? So, that would uh, like, uh, already given hint uh, about uh, her being able to hear what uh, they think, because if they are unconscious, they are not going to be able uh, to think about anything. So yeah, I wonder if it's like that, but uh, they will probably uh, explain that uh, at some point. Uh, I'm just uh, waiting for the, the confirmation right now. But yeah, it's really interesting to see all of this. Right now, they are going to go... Uh, gold hunting since uh, I mean they're pirates and uh, there's a uh, supposedly a gold um, like gold in this place but I'm almost sure that the location of the of the gold is probably really close to this god Eneru so I still want to see this guy and right now it really looks like um, it's only god Eneru and these priests uh, being the bad guys here I'm not too sure but it looks like these gorillas the the, like the the people currently fighting um, against these priests, they don't seem to be that bad. At the start, they were attacking uh, uh, the, the straw at uh, crew members uh, when they were first uh, arriving at the Sky Islands. But right now, it really seems that uh, there is more to it, and they were not uh, like looking like bad people. But yeah, I'm going to have to see more of this to be completely sure about everything. Right now. I'm really invested on this uh, part of the story. I find it really interesting, especially the fact that uh, this uh, upper yard is actually uh, part of this island from before, uh, Jaya. And yeah, I really want to, to see more of this. I really can't wait for this next episode. So with this, I really hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to this one. And if you did, please like and subscribe to the channel. And you can also join my Discord and my Patreon if you want to get early access to my full reactions. So yeah. I'll see you all in the next one, so take care guys!